All right, moving along. Let's get into a little step-by-step -step on... This is my new art project, and I want to do it step-by-step -step from the beginning. This was kind of a light 150 grit sand out on... I had a few dings on this one from Baja Malibu. I actually landed on my ass on this board when it flipped upside down. And it's been like that for a long time. So I kind of knocked it down. The, the hot coat I put here. So this is all smooth. I just pulled the fins. So anyway, this is going to be a... Um, of art replication that there's a little story to it this is the, this is one of my kevlar vacuum bag kevlar layups and this is one from the with the energy label this was my late label for um a lot of years so now it's Enigma Surf Designs, and I'm developing more clientele again and getting a website worked on by a buddy of mine to get these Kevlar boards in the mainstream. It's really pretty stuff, actually. And just for an example, look how flat the deck is. This board's like seven years old. It's like no pressure dents. So, the main one of the main reasons I picked this is because this board will I'll probably have this board until I can't surf anymore because it's like one of these weird things I started developing with some guys that wanted on like boards that were hard to break and I have perfected it now and this thing I'll have this thing forever so. First thing I'm going to do is mask this off and shoot the bottom white with um, the Sherwin-Williams 4800. That's a high gloss white. It's a linear polyurethane, but I'm going to knock it down to like a matte finish so I can get my art piece on it.